Beloved in Christ, if someone asks you this question, how do you know uh, that you are a child of God? Uh, you know, many people would answer it with, well, um, I'm no longer what I used to be. There are those who will say, I go to church every Sunday, or I'm a Catholic, I'm a Baptist, I'm a Lutheran, uh, uh, I'm a Church of God in Christ. So I know uh, that uh, I'm a Christian. Uh, I just feel it, you know, I, 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 I'm, I'm different. And, and I know my behavior uh, is different from uh, many other people. And if I told you that all those answers were wrong, what would you say about that? Well, beloved, I want you to know, all those answers are faulty. And you know why? Because the Word of God tells us in Romans, the 8th chapter, in the 16th verse, hear these words, what the Word of God says. The Spirit itself buried witness with our spirit that we are the children of God. Now, many people will say, well, and there are many who say it, everybody is a child of God, and that is just not true. Everybody is a creation of God because God has created everyone. Uh, and man was made in the image of God. That is true. But you are a creation of God. That does not make you a child of God. What makes you a child of God is being born into the kingdom of God. That's why the Word of God says, the Spirit itself bear witness with our spirit that we are the children of God. Beloved, that's why the Holy Spirit is so very important. And as I said in earlier studies, sometimes we just kind of put that off and believe that Okay, the Holy Spirit is a force. It's, it's there. We know that it is real. Uh, but at the same time, it has no uh, space in my life. Well, beloved, according to God's Word, the only way that I know, that I know, that I know, not because I confess the Lord with my mouth and I so-called believe in my heart. Not because of the denomination that I'm a part of right now. Not because I'm a very good person and I do things that, uh, that others may not do. That you would say, well, that's a good person and that person deserves heaven. None of those answers are right. And not just because I believe, but because God's Holy Spirit bears witness with my spirit and says to my spirit, you are a child of God. You are a son of God. That's when you know for sure that you are a child of God because the spirit of God has told you so. Not man told you so. A man said that you're baptized so now you are a child of God. No, it is because the Spirit of God has said to your spirit, you are now a born again child of God. And beloved, when that happens, then there is no doubt in your mind or your heart again who you belong to. Beloved, it is the Spirit that bears witness with your spirit that will ultimately get you to a place of walking in the fullness of who God says that you are. Amen. Beloved, be blessed this day in Jesus' name.